The number of cases of tick-borne illness are growing at a rapid rate. In recent years, Lyme disease alone has gone from 30,000 cases per year to now over 300,000. But it's bigger than just Lyme disease. Wisconsin is a hotbed with a host of tick-borne illnesses that can do some serious damage. About four years ago, I was diagnosed with Lyme's disease. Um, it was a tick-borne illness, and uh, I've had quite a few complications since. I went through um, a series of um, brain fogs and confusion. I consulted with my physician and told him the symptoms. Um, at the time, he was not an advocate or a believer in uh, the idea of Lyme's disease. It's become really frustrating for me, being tired all the time, always wanting to be in bed, being fatigued, not being able to do the physical labor that I was once able to do. I've been a psychotherapist for over 40 years. I feel like the hardest thing for people with Lyme's is not being believed. Tick-borne illness is a bigger problem than the general public can fathom. My family and my friends can't understand the pain I go through on a daily basis. Coming to terms with it so that my relationships and my friends understand why I stay in bed, why I don't go to work, why I have to have my employees take care of things for me, it becomes tricky on relationships and it almost pushes them away. It's a loss. It's a loss for health care. It's a loss for um, individual care across the board. Of the 22,000, I suspect there's probably another uh, larger percentage than that that goes undiagnosed and unreported because there is no uh, treatment facility in the state of Wisconsin at this particular point in time. The closest facility that can treat tick-borne illnesses is 1,200 miles away. If we had a center up here, that would first of all be, I think, a great relief to the medical community. Tick-borne illnesses are only expanding, so we're going to have more and more of this, and I really think it's unfair to ask people who are untrained in this, not to mention we don't have good research to fall, to fall back on, to try and sort this all out. We need your help. A tick-borne illness center is the answer. A place for people to get integrated, individualized care. A hub for data collection. Routine clinical lab testing. And cutting edge research. A place for effective diagnosis, treatment, and follow-up care. A place where collaboration is the norm. Sharing information with clinicians and researchers. At home and across the country. Is the only way that tick-borne illnesses will be stopped. The demand in not only our immediate area, but our entire region is evident. Be part of the solution. Your donations will truly make a difference in the way in which tick-borne illnesses are treated, prevented, and hopefully one day cured.